see in this case uh, the next concept is called as a file and directory permissions are there so if you create a file or if you create a directory and how to identify file or directory means for example the last point displays a name of the file or directory but in this you can say the first one if you use the command name is called as a ls hyphen l ls hyphen l it is the like this way the first one d indicates the directory in the first one it display like hyphen that indicates the file first character you can say d means and the directory in the first character you can say hyphen is there means and that is the file and next point in this case r r means is called as a read permissions and w means this is called as a write permissions and x means execute permissions if the script file is there we have to execute the file and read write x and it has some values also read has the value called as a 4 and write has the value called as a 2 and read has x as the value called as a 1 and these values is called as a ch mode values ch mode values and now in this case how many characters means totally we got 10 characters are there so in this say example now the first three the pin r w x is there and these are the permissions for the owner the pin who is created the file or directory is become as a owner permissions for the owner and the remaining three these are permissions for the group and the last three these are permissions for the others okay so i count this way so the first character indicates the to find out whether directory or file so so others means it may be any one say example now i'll go for suppose example who is the owner means d1 is a owner example and group is called as a development is a group in the development who are the members are there example Let's say example D10 is the owner. D1, D2, D3, D4. These are the group. Others means except these users, the remaining people they call as the others. Except these users call as the the remaining people is called as the others. Say example now. D. R W X R I P N X R I P N X. This for the first one to identify the directory or file, and uh, remaining three, these are for the user or you can say the owner, and uh, these three for the group. and these three for others and you can see the permissions values r is equal to what is the value r is equal to 4 and w is equal to 2 x is equal to 1 the pin r value you can write it here 4 and w value 2 x value 1 The pin total value how much now? Four plus two plus one. The pin seven. I count this way. This value four. I pin is there. I pin means simply can write it as zero. And x value one. The pin five. 
4 plus 0 plus 1. The pin by default, if we create a directory, who is created, we get the permissions called as read, write, execute for directory. And for the, use, for the group and others, they got only read and execute permissions only by default. By default, these are default permissions. Default value is called as a 755. So, if he is a user, hmm. he is not one of the uh, Yes. But he remains in that group. He can, he can modify. Yes, he can modify. Suppose if he give the permissions called as a RWX, the pin, even the whole members in the group, these people also they can able to modify the directory they can able to modify the file so here permission is given but to others their permission is you simply can say zero 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 so uh, we can modify uh, check and write yes so i shall show it practically so example what i can do means for testing purpose i'll create a one directory A directory name is called as a example quality. Okay. So use the command name is called as a ls. First of all, go to root. So ls hyphen l. So what directory created quality 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 here so this is the directory name is called as a quality the directory name and for this directory these are the default permissions rwx r hyphen x r hyphen x who is the owner root is the owner who is the group root is the group now first thing, I want to change the permissions. I want to change the permissions. The pin only root only has to open this folder. Rest of all the people they should not open. So what I can do is, we got some command name is there. The command name is called as a chmode. chmode is a command. ch mode is a command to change the permissions of a file or directory to change the permissions of a file or directory we can use the command is a ch mode suppose i will use this way ch mode 7 0 0 So 700 means this indicates for user RWX for group no access for others also no access. We will get this way D RWX and hyphen 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 for the duty directory quality directory. So we can check it out now. CH mode 7 0 0 0 next point which directory name quality now go for ls hyphen l you can see the quality directory now you can see the quality directory this is the quality directory is there for this quality directory only for the user only we get the complete permissions for the group and others no access is there for testing purpose login is some other username i'm logging as a username example you can say b1 user su hyphen and username 
b1 okay no problem so go to directory name is called as a root directory i'm in which directory now i'm in the root pwd command oh. present working directory cd backslash means is going to main root change directory so now go to directory name ls you got some directory name is available here the directory name is called as a quality and you want to enter into directory cd quality so it simply give the message okay because the reason only owner who is the owner root is the owner only okay say example now i have the directory name is called as development directory okay and for this directory some username is called as a team lead team lead is a user and you require the complete permissions you require the read write execute on the development directory and now we got some group name is called as a development is a group is there already we created development is a group is there and this is a group under this group who are the members are there d1 d2 d3 d4 already we added and these users the people who are the members in this group they require only read and execute permissions only and rest of all the people except these people the rest of the people they require the permission called as a the people rest of the people means others no access anybody should not open anything which directory development directory how we can do it now see the first command will go for this way ch mode this is a value you can say for user 7 5 no access means 0 to which directory develop this is over the pin for user i got the full control for the group they got the read and execute for others you can say no access but now what is the requirement means some username is called like a team lead is username this user has to become as a owner so we can first thing create some username is called as a team lead team lead you can create user already we create a group name is called development we get some other commands are there ch1 ch1 is the command to change the ownership and ch uh, grp to change the group ship so by using these commands we can change the ownership and group ship and we can test it so first thing ls final i got some directory name is called as a development directory so directory name is the development okay and i want to change the permissions now so ch mode 750 to which directory name development uh. okay then in go for ls hyphen l with the directory name is the development directory and you can see the for development directory for the who is the owner is the rwx only and for the group you can say r hyphen x for rest of the people you can say no access 
and oh, but whereas you can say the ownership the ownership will be to whom right now the ownership will be for the root user and group ship also for the root user to change the ownership first of all create some user id name user id example you can say team lead and uh, not less it is password and use the command name is called as a ch1 mine is second get Ch phone will go for the to which user name to which directory name yeah. and go for ls hyphen l and you can see the development directory before it was the root is there but now we can see this one. Who is the owner now? Team lead is the owner for the development department, development directory. The pin the who is the owner? You get the permissions called as a R W X. And now I want to change the group ship. To change the group ship, we get one more command name is called as a C H G R P. Already we got some group name is there. The group name is called as a development. to which directory name develop so go for the command name is called as a to verify ls hyphen l you can see the directory name now this is a directory name development directory who is the owner team lead is the owner for this owner what the permissions are there r w x and the group development is a group name and for this development group name what the permissions are there are hyphen x only and rest of the people others no access the pin now if you log in as a team lead user name you can able to modify the directory you can able to anything also if you log in as a who are the members in the development directory d1 d2 d3 these are the members are there if you log in as these users we can able to read the data only but they can't able to modify anything except these users if you log in as some other user name example we create some user name balu if you log in as some other user name we can't able to access the folder we can see that practically now for verification purpose so log in as which user name su ipen user name is called as a team lead i log in as a team lead now go to directory name is called as a dalam and i can able to create anything also example cat greater than some file name file 1 control d to save okay so right now on development directory i got some direct file is available and i got some directory also is available and i'll create one more directory called as a example new project so these all the things are available in the development directory so now log out log in as a user name so to log in as a some other user name su ipen Some other username you can say D2. Right now we are logged as which username is D2 username. And go to the root directory. Okay. And CD and go to directory name is called as a development. Develop. And you want to create one directory name. because the reason he is a member in the group for the group i given the permissions called as a 
read and execute only and I need to give the permissions called the write permissions. So now log out and log in as some other username. Example s2 iPen, some username is called like a poly username created. When you log in as username, it asks in the password. So right now log in as which username now? Balu. So now try to open the directory name. The directory name is called as develop. Because the reason he is not member in the development group. He is the other user. Okay. So like this way, what you can do is we can provide the permissions to a file or directory. Okay, by using this command, you can say ch mode command, ch one, ch grp. Okay, we have created a user accounts and group accounts, and we are seeing the how to provide the permissions for the file or directories. Okay, so this is the way in the real time point of view there is.